Hello friends, this is my first attempt to create something usable from an e-based which I have named as a portable air cooler it's the world's first portable air cooler made from an e-waste specifically an SMPS what I had done is first I had used an old SMPS which is usually as we had seen this kind of SMPS generally uh, when they are not in use they are a waste which cannot be used anywhere and I used some dry batteries now what I have done is first I had removed all the pins all the hooks from four places and then I opened this and before doing this just a caution as it contains some electronic stuff do it under proper guidance or with proper safety after doing this I had removed the internal components all what I had done is I had removed all the components from here and I had left two stuffs as you can see the first is this is right now it's not usable what I wish to do is I will do some windmill kind of stuff over here or some renewable stuff which will make this entire thing rechargeable and two wires from this fan this fan has con contained two wires which were inside that circuit which I had removed and I had got it over here and I had placed it like this so that I can place two of my batteries over here and then uh, as we all know SMPS removes heat from the computer's ca cabinet the CPU cabinet so it has the property of uh, uh, getting the heat out of here so it will take air from here and it will throw it outside from this side it will take air here and it will throw it from this side so what I done what I thought of using this property of SMPS I what I will do is I will put uh, what we can do is we can put some ice inside this and put it right over here you can put it like this and put the ice over here or such material which can provide cool coolness over here and that coolness would be transferred from the air which would be flown from this chamber inside this and it will be flown outside in a directed position you can keep the ice outside also like this but this won't give a directed flow whereas this will give you a directed flow from this side and you can then cover can put the ice over here and then you can cover it like this you can again put the nuts and all other stuff over there and then now the power part as we can read it over here it needs some 3.3 voltage if it can focus it needs some 3.3 voltage and the dry batteries are somewhere around 1.5 voltage here so I have to combine two dry batteries and then I can put it something like this in this manner we can put it and then this fan will start flowing and it will flow it will throw the cool air over here now uh, what where could be it could be used it could be used when there is no electricity as uh, as you know many places uh, are there where the light can go just without any uh, just without any notice so it would be tough to stay out there and whatever ice or material such material you have in your refrigerator it will also eventually uh, will be flown away without any use so what you can do you can take all that ice put it in this box use the batteries and then get a uh, air cooler kind of stuff available and this is portable you can take it anywhere and as it is created from e-waste it is uh, it could be used as a useful stuff and can keep it as a handy stuff what future we can do is uh, future enhancement instead of using the dry batteries we can use this to to create some kind of uh, power generation by making some coil by various methods <coughs> you can also use any of the renewable stuff so it would be an entirely uh, it would be a stuff which would be running entirely on uh, on natural resources 
instead of that cool ice you can suggest uh, you can suggest me some other stuffs also and in this way we can create a complete portable air cooler which could be used anywhere by anyone and it is easily available as we all know SMPSs are the only computer unit which breaks down so easily and they are of no use then once they are uh, out of service uh, with all that thanks good luck and give me your suggestions if any goodbye